Hey guys, we just finished watching Canelo Alvarez and uh, Danny Jacobs fight, and it was a good one. You know, it was good to see these two professionals leading up to the fight. There wasn't a lot of trash talking going on. They let their body of work do their talking and all that and their history, and, and they, they, they were professionals about this fight. Up until the weigh-in, of course, where uh, Danny gave a little headbutt here to Canelo, and that got things going. And the fact that uh, Danny, on the, the weigh-in this morning, didn't care to make weight, and had no problem giving a million dollars back to, to Canelo in order to have the, the weight advantage going into tonight's fight. You know, the fight was good. The first the first four rounds, you know, dominated by Canelo, exactly what we expected. It was very Mayweather-esque. You know, the defense was outstanding by Canelo. He was slipping punches left, right, and center. You know, and, and Danny didn't know what to do. Jacobs had no, uh, no answer for Canelo. You know, Canelo was hitting. He was hitting accurate and hitting hard. Okay, and that's a dangerous combination when you got Canelo Alvarez accurately hitting you and hitting you hard. Uh, you know, Danny picked it up. Jacobs picked it up in the, you know, eighth, ninth round. He got some energy. He came with some flurry of punches. You know, rock Canelo a couple times. Well, it's funny because, you know, he, he, he hit a good cross right on Canelo right in the face and rocked him good and goes back to the corner, Canelo, and, and, and his, his, uh, his corner's like, did you feel it? He's like, nah, no, nah, didn't feel it at all. Canelo's a tough guy. He's tough. He's tough to beat. He's strong. He's powerful. He's in his prime right now. You know him. Him fighting Mayweather right now would be totally different than him in the first Mayweather fight. So Canelo is on top of the game. He is the best middleweight out there. There's, there's no, there's no doubt about it. And because Jacobs is not a Jacobs is not a, he's not a cakewalk. He's no, he's no fielder that we walked over last time. You know this is a good fight, Jacobs. At the end, he he went he came at him. Jacobs came at Canelo in the ninth, tenth, eleventh rounds. Unfortunately, it was too late. Canelo already won the fight by then. The only thing that could have helped uh, Jacobs there if he would have knocked him out, or at least knocked him down to to make the fight close. Um, Canelo just controlled too many rounds. His punches are clean, accurate, and hard, and the judges love that. You know, there's part, there's part uh, there's parts in the fight where Jacobs would hit Canelo like four times, but all you'd see is the one punch that Canelo hit him with. Because it was clean, accurate, and hard. And that's what the judges are seeing. And another victory for Canelo, guys. Um, no controversy here. Canelo totally won the fight. Um, well officiated, well scored. And and um, Canelo is now the unified middleweight champion of the world. And he deserves it. And we look forward to his uh, his next fight, hopefully against GGG or somebody else. That'll uh, bring us some action. All right, guys. We'll catch you next time.